back now, crew. Before we even get started, I want to show you guys this. So Model Ones is having a $50 giveaway. And yes, I am going to enter. If I can enter five times, I will be entering five times. So here are the rules. You can take a screenshot of this and enter after the video is over, okay? So rewind if you need to, take a screenshot, and off you go. Now, I do have two boxes. I'm going to keep one, and I'm going to give one away. So as soon as I hit 20K, guys this may potentially be yours so i'm going to show you guys what's in both of the boxes they are very very similar this one the handout's a little different but anyway the boxes are pretty much the same they have the same color poly gels um i think the main difference with this kit are these gel pods some of the colors are the same but for the most part that is the only difference so let me show you guys what's at the bottom so you take the top layer off and down here in the basement you have a file you have a lamp you have bling there's a whole bunch of stuff going on downstairs so i'm going to keep a box and i'm going to give one of you a box so stay tuned as soon as i hit 20k we shall be calling names that's all i gotta say all i gotta say you gotta rock with me you gotta help me grow and i will be giving things away to say thank you okay so i decided to keep this box here and and give away the other one i don't know why because they're pretty much the exact same um, but i just randomly picked one so anyway you get alcohol swipes that i just showed you you're gonna get three poly gels pink white and clear and this is some really good poly gel i have demonstrated it for you several times you're also going to get the top coat and the base coat everyone loves a good model one top coat and base coat so i mean i really don't need to say anything about it it's really good stuff and then of course you're going to get these color pods i'm going to swatch them for you guys so just stay tuned if you like watching swatches you shall see me swatch all right so downstairs in the basement we have some dual forms and these are the big ones these are the ones that everyone wants because you guys all say you have huge thumbs and the regular dual forms don't fit you if these don't fit you Mm, some ain't right <laughs> and these are too big unless you're a guy i know guys wear nails i know guys wear nails now but you see how big that is on my thumb if you're a man i could get i could get it i could get it but if you're a female and these do not fit you honey i don't know what to tell you you're gonna have to just use a paper form and sculpt your nails on a paper form or use tips to be honest though i really feel like these dual forms fit mostly anybody whether you have big thumbs or not these should fit you all right so now let's look at my little lamp so i have another lamp just like this one so i am showing you guys what it looks like fresh out of the box but i'm not going to really open it because i don't want it i don't want to disturb her let's just let her stay in her little package i am going to use this one here for the video as you can tell it is from the same company it says model ones right there so is the same one that's in the box but i just don't want to use that one i'm just gonna tuck her away maybe i'll give it away maybe i'll have a giveaway we'll see how generous i feel when i hit 20k but this is what the lamp looks like you just cure your nails it is a six watt lamp and it does cure surprisingly it does cure your poly gel and your gel pods and things like that i'll actually use it in the video today when i swatch i'll use that lamp when i play with the poly gel i'll also use that lamp so you can see that it is powerful now we also got some bling and i'm trying to shake it because it's kind of stuck to the top and you can't really see the blinginess of it but it's in there and it's blinging all right now this little tool i showed you guys this before it is a cuticle remover. I do not recommend you use this on anybody but yourself because it is sharp. And if the client moves, you will cut them and they will bleed. So I suggest if you don't know how to use it, don't use it at all or just use it on yourself. I use these quite often. I like them. I grew up watching my mom use it. So I'm, you know, I'm accustomed to using it. But if you're new, leave it alone or give it away all right so we also have a nice soft fluffy brush i am going to give that brush away as well because i do have plenty of those brushes so i will put that in a little giveaway and now we have some striping tape uh, yes i hit that note that note was hit all right so all these beautiful colors 
particularly i love that purple one the blue one and the green one yeah the gold's okay too but that purple and that blue and that green was like really calling my name right, let me try to put it back I never could put these things back. I never forget it. Just forget it. Just oh, I never could put okay, whatever. Alright, so oh, we also have a file. A hundred on one side and a hundred and eighty on the other side. And then we have a beautiful little cuticle pusher. I do have a thousand of these as well. So I will be giving that away. Guys, when I hit 20k, my giveaway is gonna be so awesome. I'm already planning for it now. Alright, so here is a rhinestone picker upper tool a pair of tweezers all us nail girls need a good pair of tweezers to pick up our bling and i do have one of those and i use it quite often and here is a number six gel brush i actually like these gel brushes and i have one exactly like it that i'm going to use here it is so as you can tell oh my gosh what the what i had some hair in there how do I get red hair in my gel brush? What the hell? Um, <laughs> but it's the same thing. Okay. Mine is the red hair. All right. So now I want to show you guys something else that I'm going to give away. I'm going to have nothing. At the, it, I'm going to just give away everything. <laughs> so these cream pods, guys, these are cream pods. And I did a video on these already okay so i will leave a link below if you guys want to catch that video but i will also be giving away these cream pods they are gorgeous it's just that model one sent me another batch of them and i was like you know what let me go ahead and bless the nail crew so these cream sets are awesome and when i did that video i was so impressed i am now going to share it with one of you guys so stay tuned for that now these are the glitter pods i'm going to swatch these i don't think i have these these are um these are new to me i believe i'll check i'll check my stash to see if i have any repeat of these colors but i don't think so and these are all glitter baby even if i have double i don't think i'm gonna give y'all my glitter i think i'm gonna keep i'm gonna be selfish with my glitter y'all and so it also comes with this cute little brush you just pull it to open it just like that i think that is amazing yeah yeah all right so let's go ahead and swatch let's just go ahead and swatch you guys can watch me play with these cream pods so the reason why i'm posting this video today um model ones had sent me four <laughs> they sent me four boxes at one time so you saw the two that they just sent me so that's two and then they sent me another two boxes and the other two boxes are really big so i wanted to do that video first because they're really big boxes and i was like ah yeah I gotta get the video out but today I was talking to one of my nail sisters hey girl hey hey girl hey I think I'm gonna go on her Instagram and steal a picture and post it here no 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 I think I'm gonna go on her YouTube and steal her YouTube name or whatever so you guys can go harass her and say hey girl hey but anyway I was talking to her today and she just graduated nail school. I'm so proud of her. I just get on her Instagram sometime and I, I just leave her a message and just say, I'm just so proud of you. <laughs> she probably thinks i'm a whole weirdo but i am because i remember girl i'm so sorry for telling your business but i remember like before she started nail school she was a little apprehensive for her own personal re reasons and i get that and i just was like you know trying to push her and encourage her to do it and she actually did it and now she's finished and I just cannot, I feel like I know her. I do not know her, but I feel like I know her. And I'm just, oh, so proud of her. You know what I mean? Just, just knowing her story and her situation. And she overcame that and she went to school and now she has a full career. So anyway, long story short, she and I was talking today and being that she just graduated, she's like unsure of which products to carry. I understand that, especially when you have to factor in cost and are your clients going to be able to afford it? And you just don't want to go into a new business, waste of money, blah, blah, blah. 
So anyway, one of the topics that we were talking about was gels and glitter gels and things like that. What company should you carry? Because you definitely don't, especially being new, and this is for anybody, you definitely don't want to come out the pocket spending so much money on a product that you don't even know if it's going to fit your clientele. You don't know what colors they like. You don't know if they even going to like glitter. <laughs> you know, not everyone's into glitter. <laughs> so you definitely don't want to jump out the gate and just spend way too much money. You kind of want to, you know, budget a little bit down until you see how well you're thriving. So anyway, I told her that I will post a video with some polish pods today, which I am doing. And I just wanted to swatch these for her so that she could see they're super affordable they're actually having a black friday sale so honey if you're watching if you don't catch this video too late get on their website check it out seriously check it out but anyway you are getting a good product with model ones i absolutely love 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 model ones y'all i say that all the time um but look how well this spreads and for my pods i usually only do one coat so you guys know i always double coat my polishes i i just always do that however with my pods they're so thick and pasty and that's kind of like what i was trying to tell her in our little messages back and forth on ig but it's like you know what a picture is worth a thousand words and i was like you know what let me go ahead and make a video for her so she could actually see how thick and good they are because me telling her that they're nice and they're thick and they're creamy and they're affordable <laughs> you won't go broke trying to buy them <laughs> i was like let me just get one here and just make a video and she could actually see for herself now look at this brown honey you need to get this brown in your collection because if you have a chocolate girl like me and she wants nude hello what you gonna pull out what don't pull out peach don't pull out salmon none of that you need a nice brown okay this is what you need when i say i want nude i want something like this yes this is what we talk about <laughs> and that's only one coat my darling that's only one coat and it feels a nail so well this is color 33 all you chocolate girls out there hmm Y'all better get you some 33. All right, so here is color number 35. This one to me seems very fall. It, it seems very fall. It's not bright red enough to be like a Christmas red or a New Year's red. It's like that deep, just a deep burgundy almost. I really like this color. This will also fit my skin tone very well as well. <laughs> this is a very pretty red but anyway we're not here to really focus on the colors although although <laughs> although they are banging i just wanted her to look and see the consistency of the colors and to look and see like how well they cover and how they're one coat just so you guys know you do not have to spend an arm and a leg for some really good products. So now that they are fully cured in my little mini lamp, I'm going to number them. So you guys know my polish pods get a purple sticker. So I have to just highlight these purple so that when they're on my polish or my swatch ring, I'll know where to get them. I've talked about this so many times. Some of you guys are like, okay, we get it. We get it. But um, it's just a color coding system I have. I'm not going to go into detail about it anymore because I know you guys are like, okay, we got it. Okay. But anyway, yes, if you're new here, just know that this helps me organize my swatches and it lets me know where to get what bottles, pods, top coats, base coats, regular polish, glitter polish. They're all like color coded and they're all put in a certain place on my wall okay <laughs> that's enough about that <laughs> oh my gosh all right so i have these colors divided out so i have the summer colors to the left and i have the more fall colors to the right so that's how i divided them out the full one coat coverage you saw that it was nice you saw that it was thick you saw that it was creamy i mean what can i really say like i i really didn't have to say much i just let the picture and the video do the talking and we'll just leave it at that. Oh, I want to let you guys know for Black Friday, I will leave a link below for you guys to click on it and make purchases. However, my code does not work for Black Friday, unfortunately, guys. So, hey, 
I mean, what can I say? They're still having really good deals even without my code. And what I think is really cool is they're going to have the sale for a couple days. So it's not just Black Friday. I think it's going to extend into Cyber Monday. I will leave the specifics in the description box below so you can get the link to click on from the Black Friday sale. You can also get the date that the sale is going to be on, okay? Just remember, don't use my code. I had a few of you guys try to use my code and it's not going to work for Black Friday. Actually, I don't think any of my codes for any company is working on Black Friday except for PND, Princess Nails by Diana. You can still use my code on Black Friday. All my other codes are paused <laughs> for the holiday, okay? But um, all the deals are still really, really good to the point where I don't think you need a code. And Model 1s is so affordable regardless, people. You know what I'm saying? I think you'll be fine. <laughs> so go ahead and click that link below, as I said, and just shop around, put things in your cart, you know. Um, just make sure you get it before the closing date. All right. So if you noticed, in the beginning, I showed you six glitters, right? If you guys were counting or paying attention, I showed you six glitters in the beginning. Right now, you only see three, and you're like, hmm, what's going on there? Well, what happened was I looked through all of my pods, and I realized three of them were duplicate. So I actually did have three. Now, listen, y'all, I'm giving away a lot of stuff. I'm not giving away my duplicate glitters. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. <laughs> I really, really like these glitters. <laughs> I really like these glitters. I'm going to store away the extra three. And when these run dry, I'll pull them out, okay? Now, y'all are getting a lot of stuff from me. Let me keep my three repeat glitters. Can I keep my glitters? Can I keep my glitters? Okay. Damn it. <laughs> All right, so... I'm not going to swatch those three for you because I already swatched them in a different video. I will link that below because I know you guys are like, I want to watch her swatch. I just love swatching so much. Swatching is my favorite. Okay, so for you people that love to watch swatching, and I'm one of those. I love to watch it. I just hate to do it. So anyway, I'll leave a link to that video below. You guys can see me play with that whole collection and you can see how awesomely gorgeous all the colors are so anyway these three as you saw went on very nice and i'm only gonna do one coat with the glitter as well sometimes with glitters you have to do two coats because it's not packed enough and there's too like many spaces and all that but i feel like the formula here is pretty good and you could get away with just one coat and that's all i'm gonna do is one coat because i'm trying to save it because i really like it and yeah no other reason. So here are all of them, guys, all six. So the ones to the left, these are the ones that came in the other kit or the repeats that I did not swatch. The ones to the right are the ones you watched me swatch. All right, now let's get into the poly gel. I have demonstrated Model 1's poly gel for you guys so many times. And you guys know it is one of my top three poly gels. I actually did a video a while ago. A while ago. I can't remember when, but I know it was some time ago. It was way before coupon codes were even brought up. It was way before, you know, they started to sponsor me and all that. Um, I wonder if they saw my video and that was why. Hmm, I don't know. I wonder. <laughs> Maybe I should ask them. But anyway, a while back, I did a video where I compared six different poly gels. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I compared six different poly gels and I thought for sure going into it that I already had a clear cut favorite. So when I sat down to do the video, I felt like I already knew who my winner was going to be. Like, I was like, okay, I already know. I love this particular brand. This is going to be the winner, but let's just see what happens. But anyway, by the end of the video, that was not the case. And I was very shocked that Model 1s ended up being my favorite from that video. I was very shocked because I knew going into it that I already had a favorite. So yeah, Model 1s had knocked my favorite down to second place. And I was... uh 
I was kind of surprised. <laughs> I was shocked. I, didn't, I couldn't believe it, <laughs> but it happened. So anyway, you guys already know I love a good Model 1 poly gel because it's nice. I like the consistency. It's nice and, and firm. And I just personally like a firm poly gel. Um, soft or firm, they all work well. So don't hit me with those questions. What do I think work better? A soft poly gel or a firm one? They all work well, but it's just a personal preference if you like a firmer one or a softer one. I just like a firm one because I could put the poly gel on all five fingers if I want to and work them in order from pinky to thumb and not worry about it sliding off the nail <laughs> and flooding the cuticle. That's the only reason why I like a firm poly gel. So anyway, I built the nail with a thin layer and I just kind of did a simple quick file into shape. And now we are going to just throw on some glitter just to play with some of these glitters. I wasn't I didn't plan to do this. I just wanted to show the consistency of the gel pods, show the clarity and the consistency of the poly gel. But I'm like, you know what? Here we are. I'm here. Might as well just continue. Might as well just finish playing. Um, I hate when my videos are too long, but this is going to be well over 20 minutes. And I hope you guys watch it and enjoy it. This is just going to be really simple. I'm just going to throw some glitter on the nail randomly just so I can encapsulate it so we can see how clear the poly gel is if you use it to encapsulate glitter. So pretty much that's the only thing that I'm doing here, just randomly throwing glitter on the nail and we'll just play like that. Um, no real design or pattern going on. We just, we just throwing it on. Now, I don't think this one came in my kit today. I must have grabbed it by mistake, but anywho, it's a real pretty color and it matches. And I just wanna put a little more blue because I really, I'm digging this blue. So I just want it to pop out a little bit more. So just throwing it on the nail. I think that looks cute. And I'm going to cure it for 60 seconds. All right, so now let's go ahead and encapsulate it. So I have my poly gel again. And I'm just going to pour it right on the nail. Just like that. <laughs> it's already clear. I didn't even work it in or anything. And it still looks clear. All right, so let's just pat it in place. If for some reason you did not want to encapsulate this with the poly gel, you don't have to. You could definitely put the glitter on the nail and then cap it in clear. That's fine. You could absolutely do that. I just wanted to see how clear this poly gel would be over the top of glitter. So that's really why I'm doing this, just to see how clear it would be. And as you can tell, you can see right through it. I mean, I still have to file it and, and all that jazz, but you can see right through it. So I would say this is a thumbs up. Okay, let's go ahead and pop her in the oven and cure her for 60 seconds. Now there is a sticky inhibition layer with this poly gel, much like all poly gels and all hard gels. You just have to spray it with some alcohol and wipe it down. And then we're gonna take our little hand file and filey file, filey file, File our little hearts out. You do not need an e-file for poly gel because you guys know it's a little bit softer than acrylic. But I don't want to tell you guys it's softer than acrylic and then you guys feel like, oh, poly gel is soft because that's all you'll hear is the word soft. And then you feel like they're not strong or they're not durable. They are very strong, very durable. And in a lot of times or a lot of cases... I could keep my poly gel nails on longer than acrylic nails. I don't know why, but that's just how it works out sometimes. So don't feel like poly gel is not as strong. It's actually just as strong, if not stronger. Okay, so I filed it and buffed it and we are ready for that top coat, darlings. So whenever you have a semi-transparent nail, you might wanna get underneath just so it can shine from the top to the bottom and the bottom to the top so we can get all shiny honey yes let's go ahead and bake her in the oven for 60 seconds Woo! yes boo come on first of all the glitter is banging the glitter is banging okay you got chunky pieces you got fine pieces it uh and all the colors just go together so well i just love it and that poly gel is clear and it works so well the top coat gleaming it is gleaming, okay? <laughs> Model ones, high five to you again. You did that. All right, guys, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, 
share and visit my description box below i will see you guys tomorrow bye